Hi YouTubers, welcome to my video and today I've got Beko WTK104121A. I'm just going to show you how to install it. The first things you're going to do is just to turn off your water. This is going to turn off all the water in the house. So make sure that you run your tap and everything is empty. You don't need to do this but uh, it's a good practice. So I would recommend to do that. Then you're going to remove these four screws. This, these are transportation screws. What I'm going to use, it is number 10. You can use the number 10 spanner, but uh, for easiest things to do is just use the, this type of spanner. Right. Once everything is loose, you just need, I mean, just uh, to pull it out, just like that. You're going to do for all four of them. Just pull them out. Then you're going to take the plastics which come with the washing machine and you're going to stick those plastic there. Do this for all four of them. After you have finished doing this, we are going to connect now the pipe. This is the one which runs the water from the tub to the washing machine. When you do this, it's good practice also, I mean, to tighten. Uh, you can use like a pliers if you want, or you can use a, a rug to hold it. Make sure that there's no leak because this is electric electricity and uh, you might find leak all over your house you don't want to do that you're going to take that pipe to connect the water hose and also try to tight it if uh, you feel like there's any leak you can use the white tape make sure that everything is tight you can use the rug as well just to tight it and try to run the water and see if uh, the water there's any leak at this time I have already opened my water from the house now I'm going to remove that to connect this uh, the dirty water hose and you are going to install it inside I mean try to tight it as well and you can use like a clamp I'm just gonna show you after I have uh, installed it so I'm happy that it is tight at the moment and now I'm just going to put it under the sink. This is where I'm going to connect my dirty water. Also make sure that uh, when you do this, you tight it because uh, again, you don't want to have any leak which might cause mold and mildew in your house fungus which uh, you don't want to do that because everything is going to be under the sink and uh, you won't notice it. but you might find that uh, the air inside your house is not good anyway so try to take a rug again and try to tight it and make sure there's no leak as I said After this process, you can add the clamp as shown on the picture if you want. And uh, then just connect your electricity and turn on your washing machine. Make sure everything is okay and the water comes in inside the washing machine. So thank you very much for watching. And if you have got any comment, you can just type it on the comment box. Please don't forget to subscribe.